Hi. In this video, I will create a bed job. Uh, bed job is a periodic job uh, you can uh, run uh, periodically. Uh, for this uh, tutorial, uh, I will use my duty table. In my duty table, I have an end date and uh, I want to send a notification, an email or something else to uh, to this uh, consultant or responsibles uh, for uh, if the duty step is open and the end date is come, I want to notify them. Okay, uh, for this I need to uh, create a class of course. I have I have uh, two options. I can use uh, run base batch framework or sales operation framework. In this tutorial, I will use run base batch. It's an old system, but still working fine. Uh, for this, uh, go to classes and tutorials, and we have a run base batch tutorial run base batch here. You can right click and duplicate in project. This one. Let's change the name. Now uh, it's it's a tutorial because of this uh, we have some uh, parameters here but we don't need these parameters we can delete this one this one and uh, we don't need any dialog this dialog field okay we can clear this one. Let's copy the name of the class and we need to change uh, construct method so this one, this one. Also, we need to change main method here. Okay. Now it's almost ready. Let's go. We don't have. Count this. Hmm. Okay. This creates one variable for our macro. This one. Okay. Now you need to write your code in this section. Uh, this is the place. Uh, where uh, we will write our uh, code. For this, I need duty, of course. I don't need transaction block because I will not update anything. Maybe like this. Okay. Of course, also I need to filter. And date, and this should be like uh, equal or uh, more than uh, today. 
Uh, this is the records uh, where end date is finished and status is not finished. So for this record, I want to, uh, for example, send an email. I will not write an email code here, uh, but let's look for this report. Okay, now it's almost ready. Let's create, let's change description here. Okay, now let's create a menu item for this one, new item. Link user interface for this kind of uh, things uh, class we need action menu item Object type, of course, class and okay. Now my main item is also ready. Let's go back to our main extension and add this to our activity. Okay, now it's ready. Let's uh, rebuild our solution and uh, see if it works. Okay, let's look at our menu. Okay, the status check is here. Now let's click. It, it's because RAM based uh, framework, we have uh, this batch processing. If I uh, said no and okay, it will run automatically. Let, let's run first. Okay, there, there is 10 records. As you can see, these are our records. Let's go back. And if I select this one and if I select the recurrence, for example, I can uh, give this one uh, to like this, no end date, and it should work. This works, for example, PM in night, and okay. If I set this one and this one, uh, I it will add automatically a batch up to our batch process. Uh, let's add and go back to system. And inquiries and batch jobs. Look at our page up here. Okay, this is my page up and it's waiting for work. Now I can uh, check if it is worked or get error, etc. And every uh, every day it will work and uh, send notification to a related uh, consult. 
and uh, this is this is a very uh, simple uh, example of uh, periodic jobs, uh, bed job, and I hope it's helping helping reproduction.